Hello YouTube world, it has been a long ass time since we posted a video. We apologize. We finally decided to get lives. So today we are bringing you a wonderful rant video uh, about people in the mall who really really piss us off. I'm going to start by saying I work at a very popular mall in my city. I work at a store that will forever have a number in its name. Who can guess what it is? And I can tell you right now, I have a whole horde of people that when they come in, I am stereotypical as fuck, and I know they're going to mess shit up. We're going to go over to Trin and see if she'll finally talk, you know, 30 seconds into this. I don't like the mall. <laughs> <laughs> Bullshit. I avoid you, it. You shop at the mall more than I do when I work there. Oh, yeah, I know. Okay. Uh, this is my dog. She is adorable. Um, Alright, I'm going to start it off by the people who piss me off most uh, are probably the girls who go to the Roman Catholic school in my city, and they all come in wearing their uniforms, and the first thing that goes through my mind is, you're not even going to fucking buy anything today. Please go away. It's not that I have an issue with people who don't buy things when they go to the mall, but you know how fucking annoying it is that I spend, like, fucking 20 minutes folding a fucking stack of clothes that's like fucking like this tall and this wide and I got it all nice and perfect I spent 20 fucking minutes on it I turn around they touch it it's all on the fucking floor and I'm sitting there I'm like I'm a fucking knock bitch out <laughs> I'm gonna kill them all kill them all um I say this with love I'm not trying to be racist Another group that really pisses me off is the older Asian ladies who come and in. Young. Turn the All Asians. They come you in. You don't go there to buy things. You go there to go to the Apple store. Where yeah. you're fam that's like a family reunion. Try it. The whole mall. Family reunion. <laughs> everywhere. I just I've never you never see one lonely Asian. They're always in a pack. This is true. I hate to say it. I'm sorry if any of our viewers are Asian. We love you. No. I love you. I wish I could be you. You're rude and annoying. Speak our language. It's rude. <laughs> okay, that is something you. that pisses me off. Is like if I go to the mall and a bunch of people walk by speaking different language. I'm like, I'm not trying to say English is the greatest language in the world. It's fucking confusing. It's stupid. We have like there, 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 your, your, like. Or they cut in front of you or when they bump into you in the mall. Say sorry in English. Don't just look at us and go, yeah, yeah, yeah. But I don't want rice. Okay, we I can't post this story. video. We, we cannot post this video. We're going to get flagged for racism. But we're not being racist. I'm just well, saying that. Well, one of us isn't. That's just what you guys do. I'm not racist. I hate everybody equally. This is true. This is true. Um, I totally I'm not racist. I'm holding a black and white dog. And technically, she's also Mexican, so... Hola! <laughs> Vicious little bitch. Um, you totally made me lose my train of thought. Oh, Apple geniuses! Fucking people don't know shit! I walked in, I was like, Hey, um, my iPod's been a little out of, out of whack lately. Like, when I plug headphones in, it's not working. And this is like, this is the guy's response. He's like... Uh, let me go see if I can check our genius bar, and, uh, I'll get right back to you. Guy went on Google. I freaking watched him walk to the back desk and Google it. You're supposed to be an Apple genius. Why you, I could have gone home and Googled it. Or, like, Trin the other day, uh, did that new iPhone update, and it, okay. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm sorry, dog. Okay. Trin the other day did that download and she calls the Apple store and the guy tells her to restore her whole phone just to get the one update off. iOS 6. Apparently you can't get rid of it after talking to ten different people. If you know a way to, uh, link at the garage below, please. Um, and the guy told her to restore her entire phone. <laughs> um, Hollister, that store pisses me off. That store, like, I walk by it every day on my way to work at the store that will forever have a number in its name, and... It smells like baby prostitute. It does, and it's so dark in there, like, and then 
apparently in order to be like an employee there it's ridiculous standards like natural hair color red is not a natural color unless it's like orange red um, no piercings, no tattoos, you have to fit their clothes, you have to wear their clothes, it's just like... You have to use a spatula to put on your makeup. No, actually, apparently you're not allowed to wear makeup there. You're only allowed to have a small amount of eyeliner and mascara. That's where everybody's ugly. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I hate the bitches at Sears. The old ladies at Sears piss me off. You, like, walk in there and it's just like, I work at the mall, like... If I was going to steal something, it probably wouldn't be from the mall where my job would be in or jeopardy. Or they follow you around and you're in the underwear aisle. Yes, I'm going to steal a pair of gitch and socks. From Sears. Maybe La Senza, not your store. Walmart I would go for. Oh, yeah, I like Walmart. Um, I'm trying to think of more stores in that mall that piss me off. I hate the Lush store. Like It's a custom-made soap place, and I love their soaps. I absolutely adore them. I can't walk into that store without getting a nosebleed. The gray guy in there is ridiculous. Put scented licking... A, <laughs> like, you can lick the soap. He put it on my guy friend's hand and then licked it very And her sexually. guy friend is a homophobe soap. <laughs> it just... It was like... <laughs> Basically, he wanted to juggle his balls in his mouth. Um, I'm trying to think. Like, the... I never go into the bay, so I can't really bitch about the workers there. There is no workers. You will find no workers anywhere. There is more undercovers than there is workers. Try finding help in the bay or Zellers or Sears. Oh, I hate the girls at Claire's. Like, where they do the, they, they do ear piercing, ear piercing there? They do nothing. They stand there. Yeah, and then you're just like, um... Or they get mad when you ask for help. Yeah, like, I'm sorry, am I, I watched your this little time? girl go to get her ear pierced, and they were going to use a gun on a two-year-old ear. So I was like, first of all, and I'm sorry to anyone here who likes guns, blah, 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 this is my personal opinion, feel free to bitch and disagree. Guns are fucking stupid. That shit can shatter your cartilage if you're, I mean, you're using this on a two-year-old? Got stuck in my ear when I was five. Yeah. Five years. Like, first of all, you guys should be using needles. Second of all, I applied there once. I had an interview. Literally, to be an ear piercer there, you fucking read a manual and watch a two-minute video and BAM! You can pierce ears! Like, gee, thanks. No need to, like, do any professional training or anything. It's all good. I'm just gonna make you read a fucking 15-page manual and, uh, and then watch this very short, like, 15-minute video and then you can go ahead and hold a gun to people's head for a living. Sounds fucking fantastic. Um... People I hate shopping in the mall are the fucking 12-year-old girls who, like, walk in. First of all, it's fucking winter outside. Like, it's cold. I live in Canada. This shit is fucking cold here. And they get into the mall and, like, fucking, like, give their jackets to their mom or their dad. And they walk around in tank tops. Who are you fucking fooling? Like, clearly you're here with someone who's holding your jacket because it's fucking mine. It's already outside. And then, they go into stores, and they fucking mess up everything. And like I said, I work at a retail store. This pisses me off. And then, the thing that tops it off and really fucking makes me want to just oh, hit them is that they stop every five minutes to take a fucking picture with their friend while doing this. They, you're Why have a photo booth when you can just duck face in the store? Fuck Dolly out of this. She loves me. She loves anyone who gives her T-R-E-A-T-S. -E Don't say that word and call my dog, please. Um, anyway, I think that's about it for this rant. Um, I'm going to come back. I don't know if Trin will let me make videos on here without her. No. That's what I thought. But we are making another video in like an hour because I do want to talk about things that in the month of September I'm in love with even though it's really stupid and corny, but I want to do it. Hint, this water, this water will be on that list. Okay, video over. You're supposed to do the fucking piece up sign. We've done every other video.